Hey guys, we're back and uh, a lot of you might be wondering what are these artifacts that are dropping everywhere when you're doing the Manuret event, basically. So I'm gonna quickly explain what these do and what these are used for. So let's go ahead and see what different kinds are there first and then I'll explain the use of them too. So uh, basically the f there are five different kinds. Uh, and this one is um, basically the power core component, which is which is actually used to open the um, basically Scarlet's uh, secret layer gate. So that's what that is used for. And the rest of these, uh, the first one is called Watchwork Code Fragment. Second one, Aetherblade Code Fragment. Third one is the Toxic Code Fragment, and fourth, Molten Code Fragment. And the last one is Scarlet's Lock box code fragment so you need 25 of each to actually open uh, something inside scarlet layer but I'm not gonna give out any spoilers yet uh, I'm gonna uh, post up the video what's inside scarlet layer in like two or three days when every one of you has explored it yourself and seen what's inside there so <laughs> don't expect me to throw out spoilers yet so uh, these I'll actually th this is just a quick hint and tip to what to do with these so you need 25 of each of these once you have 25 uh, watchword code fragments you can combine them basically like so and you get this a watchwork cipher so uh, and then you head back to basically Scarlet's Lair once you have it unlocked and you do not need you know another 50 power core fragments for re-entry so basically once you've completed or failed on Scarlet events you will be getting these uh, Scarlet spare keys and these uh, actually give out more uh, uh, fragments for you to make into ciphers so we're gonna go ahead and uh, pick one that we have the lowest here. We have 18, 13 molten fragments. So we're gonna go for the, except for this one, you will not be getting this uh, 16 scarlet logbox code fragments. This you'll have to get from the event itself. There are five different lanes and each lane gives you a different kind of fragment. So you have to play those out and discover it for yourself. And uh, uh, we're gonna go ahead and uh, pick the molten code fragment here and open that up. And there you go, you get uh, around 5 uh, from each one, so we're going to get some more. We're going to get 5 more of the Molten, and 23, and let's go for the Toxic one, so we are on an even keel on there. So there we go, 5 more, and the last one, I'll probably just go for the Toxic, and bam. So once you have 25, you just uh, right click use and you get a cipher. Now this cipher is used somewhere inside Scarlet Slayer. I'm not going to disclose what it exactly does. <laughs> so uh, stay tuned for that later guys.